Sociology of Architecture, Wikipedia article audio. Sociology of architecture is the sociological study of the built environment and the role and occupation of architects in modern societies. Architecture is basically constituted of the aesthetic, the engineering and the social aspects. The built environment which is made up of design spaces and the activities of people are interrelated and inseparable. It is for us to understand this interrelationship and put it down appropriately on paper. Social institutions are many and these social institutions sometimes need functional spaces to allow the people using the building to benefit from all aspects of both the purpose of what inhabits the building and by the varied structure and organized flow of communication. The way the buildings are designed to fulfill the needs of these social institutions slash social requirements can be said to be the compliance of social aspects in architecture. Cultural Sociology Classical Sociology of Architecture Architecture is the visual shape of society. And within that, all the various building types could become objects of architectural sociology. For example, how a specific architecture expresses the structure and principles of a given society. Such sociological analysis of architecture can be found in the classic authors of sociology in Marcel Moss, Walter Benjamin, Norbert Elias, Michel Foucault, Ernst Bloch, Siegfried Krakauer, Pierre Bourdieu, Maurice Halbwax, Carol Teich, and others. The sociology of technology offers approaches to a sociology of artifacts. Initially, this sociology is interested in technical matters. While buildings are not in the core of this discipline, the perspective of architecture as artifact would be the question of interactions between architecture and subject, how a very specific architecture suggests certain ways, movements, perceptions. The term social space is used by Pierre Bourdieu and others in a more abstract sense, as social constituted spatial structures. George Simmel founded such a sociology of space and always watched the architecture of society. Simmel unfolded also an urban sociology, in his question of the specific ways of life in big cities. Urban sociology primarily deals with social structures within the city. Their points are for instance processes of segregation, urbanization, and the decline of cities. Recently, there is a research focus on differences of cities, which will be more associated with a sociology of architecture. Ronald Doss is introducing new concepts in this area, studying the history of extra-European megacities. Sociology of Architectonic Artifacts Urban Sociology and Sociology of Space 